Okay, everyone, so as you can see, this recipe calls for two cans of cream of chicken soup. Actually, it called for a can of cream of chicken and a can of cream of mushroom, but you all know I can't eat mushrooms, so I substituted for another can of cream of chicken. It calls for two chicken breasts, either shredded or diced. As you guys can see, I shredded it. I have it shredded for, pre-shredded for um, other meals as well, so uh, I'm using that's about two, two chicken breasts worth of shredded chicken. Then it calls for a, what is it, uh, half a cup of cheddar, which I don't have, so you see I used marble, and a cup and a half of mozzarella, so that's all in there. Uh, it also calls for two tablespoons of Parmesan, which I do not have, so I have this little package left over from uh, when we did a pizza kit that I'm gonna mix in with that um, and everything, so. All right, and then next, it calls for sour cream, uh, two cups of sour cream. I only had mayo in the house, so I'm only substituting one cup of mayo. So I'm hoping it'll turn out okay. It calls for a half a cup, of, half a cup of broth. So that's where I'm using my cup measure. So there's my half a cup of broth right there. It also called for a half a cup of margarine melted. So there's it's there. A half a cup of peas, which is right here. And then of course the spaghetti that you need for the uh, base of the, the meal. So, and then of course any you know spices you might want to add to it and so on and so forth, which everybody knows is my go-to is uh, paprika and garlic. So I will uh, get the spaghetti started and we will be back with you guys shortly. All right, everyone. So as you can see, I've got my mixing bowl in front of me and I've opened my cans of cream of soup. So we're just gonna kind of mix it all together now. That's what it calls for with this recipe, so that's what we're gonna do. Oops, sorry, I kinda hit the camera. All right, so as you can see, everything's now in there, so now we have to mix it to thoroughly combine it. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a little bit of garlic, a little bit of paprika, and we're gonna add the Parmesan to it. Okay, everyone, next we add the spaghetti. Here's hoping I have a big enough bowl. Oop. Okay, well it's in, so now we're just gonna have to coat the spaghetti. <laughs> that could be fun. All right, there you guys have it, all mixed up. And now it's time to add it to the um, prepared dish. Okay, everyone, so as you can see, I prepared my glass dish for uh, my lasagna pan. So I'm going to just pour this stuff in to it. Like so, nice creamy little blob there. Ooh. Oh, it's definitely filling up this more than I was expecting it to. Okay, now I have already preheated my oven to uh, 325 or 3, 350. So now I'm just going to sprinkle the cheese on, cover it nice like this. Now I don't have any chin, chin, um, tin foil, so this is going to be interesting. You're just supposed to cover it with tin foil and everything like that, and bake it for a little bit. So yeah. you work with what you have, right? That's what all this is about. All 
right, everyone, so there we have it. I'm gonna go stick it in the oven for about a half an hour and we'll be back with you guys when it's ready to be put on the plate. All right, everyone, so as you can see, I took it out of the oven and you can see it's a nice golden -y color. The cheese is nice and melted and is nice and brown. So, and it smells, I wish YouTube had Smell-O-Vision because my God, does it ever smell yummy. So now I'm gonna get it on the plate and I'll be back with you guys in a minute. A few moments later. And there you have it everybody on the plate. Doesn't that look yummy? I mean, I don't think this uh, video is doing it justice. It looks very creamy and cheesy and so good. So as per the previous video, I'm going to put down at the bottom of the screen how much the total cost was and how much it was per person. And I think there might actually be leftovers. So I'll also put the per person cost for with the leftovers. But now it's time for me to get this doled out to the family and I have a hungry bunch on my hand. So I will see everybody in the next one. Bye. More fall.